Welcome to Rochelle on TV. We're hanging out with Tay from We Are the In Crowd. What's going on? Settle, settle, settle. Premier Kids has been out for a week now. Uh, Premier 29 Billboards, number one in UK rock charts. How does it feel to get this kind of response? <laughs> Weird. <laughs> oh. Huh. Ironic. Maybe I shouldn't say that. <laughs> no, it's, it is strange though. Um, we're not used to it, so that's different. And, like, I don't know. Like, when when the first chart, like, number one rock song in or album in the UK, that was the first like, chart that we got. And I, I was just like, oh wow, that's really cool. Whoa, that's really cool. Yeah. Like, that is really cool. It and takes guess, a bit for it to sink in, I bet. It just kind of happens, and then you're like, oh, well, that's sweet. But it, it also makes you, like, really hungry for more. And I, I tweeted that, and people thought I was being mean, but I was really just saying, like, it's, it's motivating. Yeah, it is. It's good to be successful. Yeah. It feels good. Um, I know you guys were with John Feldman on this record. Uh, how is this different than any of your previous studios? So different. Um, well, first of all, John Feldman is best kind of crazy then um the best kind of crazy. yeah That's no good. really he he's like he's so eccentric but in, the, in like such an organized way and um i don't know it just he really motivated me he pushed me like outside of my comfort zone which i definitely needed um i know lyrically we needed that musically i mean there's guitar parts on this record that like i never thought the guys would write so yeah yeah i was gonna good. say like the sound is definitely mature do you think he played like a, like a bigger impact on it when we were looking for producers, we were on the phone, you know, taking calls with everybody, and we were like, we really, the, like, main thing we wanted was somebody that could do that for us, or, like, to, like, get that out of us, because we knew we could do it. There's a lot of creative freedom. There. But, yeah, we just wanted somebody to, like, make sure that it got there, and we didn't hold anything back, and he definitely did that. Yeah, it worked out. We know you guys are Warped Tour veterans. What are you looking forward to the most this summer? Mm. Oh, you know, like the, the half oh, on tan. Yeah. <laughs> That's always really cool. No, um, I don't know. I'm, ex I'm just excited to be back. I mean, we've done 2010, 2012, now 14. So it's, we're on like a two, every two year streak thing. And it should be good. We definitely know the ropes now. We're, <laughs> we're veterans yeah. now, I guess. <laughs> no, not According really. According to me, you guys are. You've done it twice, but I. So, <laughs> I'm excited. Uh, um, if you guys could go back in time to when We Are The In Crowd was first conceived, what advice would you give to yourself? Change your band name. <laughs> that would be number one. Um, Why? Because it, was, it, was, it wasn't thought out. It just happened. We are like, yeah, let's keep that. And all of a sudden, I think everything else moved so fast with our band. Like We, we didn't even have songs, and we like booked our own tour because it was weird. <laughs> and then... Yeah, I don't know. And then we were signed we right after that. We were like, oh my God, well, I guess we're keeping this name now. So. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. That's great. Uh, <laughs> if you could collaborate with another artist from a different genre, who do you think you'd want to work with? Hmm. <sighs> Somebody, I would definitely want to do like a pop R&B kind of thing because that's like my roots <laughs> so I don't know I'm a huge Pink fan everybody knows that if I were to sing with her I'd probably I probably wouldn't because I'd die <laughs> so that would be cool <laughs> that would be pretty wild though you know what I'm saying get Pink on the next on the next album if you could eat at one restaurant for the rest of your life where would you eat at? oh my gosh um does my mom's kitchen count? that absolutely does count okay cool <laughs> that's those are the best kind of we restaurants. actually have a um regional fast food list so depending on the region of the u.s and, and other countries so you guys you guys already got a line up yeah. you know what you're doing i like that you plan ahead oh, that's yeah. good food is a very important part of everything to us. <laughs> <laughs> well to close off do you have anything else to say to your fans um thanks for watching if you are watching if you have no idea who i am thanks anyway <laughs> <laughs> well thank you for watching we're sending to you right now with tape and we are the crowd.